All right, tell us about this WWE social media policy. Okay. So, so just pretend that you work for WWE, okay? <laughs> I quit. Oh. Okay. Well, I'm not going to pretend that I work for WWE. Um, don't I made it, actually? Don't we work for AEW? I don't know if we work for them, but allegedly we're paid. I still haven't gotten one paycheck yet, so I'm pretty pissed off about it. I'm not pissed off in the least. I don't want to be paid by them. Hmm. I'm joking, but <laughs> I know you're joking. Okay, so so I work for WWE. So now what? Okay, you work for WWE. Okay, okay. Let's so say me and you. You work for WWE, but I don't. Right? Okay. And we go out to dinner. So where, where are we going out to dinner? Brazilian Steakhouse. Okay. You and I go to a Brazilian Steakhouse out to dinner. You know, I knew you were going to say this. I don't have a well, good... Well, why'd you ask then? Well, it's just... An, it's, okay, here's the deal. All right. I, it's like... It doesn't matter where we go out, but I was... I figured you would say Brazilian Steakhouse, and I thought, I'm going to have, like, some joke about Brazilian Steakhouse ready... And then you did, but I didn't actually think long enough mm. to have the joke ready. So I have no good joke comeback. I'm so, but I did know you would say Brazilian Steakhouse. So we're going to Fogo de Chaos, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. And let's say that um, we're like um, like uh, wrestlers. We're not even like wrestlers. We're like normal human beings. Let's pretend. Let's just pretend, right? You know, like people on Facebook and stuff, right? And they're going out with their friends to Fogo de Chaos, right? And they take a picture in front of the Fogo de Chaos logo, right? Okay, sure, in front of yeah. the restaurant, right? We yeah, take I a picture. You. Okay, you know, we're out with all our friends. We've actually done this once. Remember, we went to Fogo de Chaos and sure, yeah. a big picture? Okay. Big picture, yeah. Okay, so if we put it on our Twitter, you know what happens? We get fired. No, we only get a, we get a warning. We get a warning. We don't get fired. No. So the point is, is that that is considered... Um, Advertising for a third party, so we can no longer do that. I thought they were concerned that we were taking pictures with some plebeians or something. Plebeians? That's like a Bobby Heenan word. So the issue is we're in front of Fogo de Chow. We're, we're promoting Fogo de Chow. Well, it could WWE's be... WWE's not it could, getting a cut of this promotion. That's the problem? Right. It could be, yeah, basically, yeah. It could be Olive Garden. It doesn't have to be Fogo de Chow. Mm. It but could if it's be, my house and my house is up for sale. Is it okay if my house is not up for sale, but if my house is up for sale, there's a problem? Uh, do you want me to ask tomorrow morning? I don't really care, but... <laughs> okay, wondering. but I do... Actually, um... <laughs> do you know the example I was given? I can't wait. Okay. Please say it was Fogo de Chow. It was not Fogo de Chow. The example I was given is if somebody had, had suggested to me tonight... That if they took a photo, a photo, and they're eating an Oreo cookie, okay, that, in fact, if they mention, now, now, they probably could get away with eating the Oreo cookie with no problems, no fines, no suspensions, no anything like that, right? Certainly not fired. But if they mention Oreo, then that's a, that's a, they, they, they've gone through the fine line. Wow. Yeah. I don't know if it's mention or hashtag. It may just be hashtag. But the point is, is that we can't hashtag Fogo de Chao. We can't hashtag. Uh, we can't do anything that is is. No, actually, to- Dave, we can because we don't work for WWE. That's a good point. Yes, we can do okay. whatever we want. Yeah, but we we still have to face the repercussions. That's what they tell Junior Carano. You can do whatever you want, but you got to face the repercussions. So, but anyway, that's the new social media policy is that on. So this is Twitter and Instagram stuff, essentially, where you can't be doing anything that is promoting another brand. Even if you're not getting any money and it's not a commercial for them or anything, you cannot do anything like that. That is forbidden now. So those are the new rules. And so I guess the deal is, is that they've explained that since they own your likeness, they believe that they own your social media accounts too. That they're but, but they'll let you they're 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 gonna be lenient. This is actually being lenient. They could actually crack down worse because they own them. But but this is but this stuff that you can no longer do. This is like finding offenses, um, is hashtagging and promoting third party things, even if you're not being paid for them. So it's kinda weird because we have this fella come over twice it's about once a year and he he drains all the water out of our uh, sprinkler system. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't own his likeness. True, but you but you don't have him under contract. 
Do you sign a contract with him where, he's, where it says, I own your likeness? I guess I don't have him under contract. Well, that's the difference. They, they've signed a contract where the WWE owns their likeness and all aspects of their likeness. So even even like the ones who've like changed their social media names from their work names to their shoot names, um, they are still, you know, it's, it, that doesn't make a difference. What if I go uh, to Fogo de Chao and I put on a fake mustache and a long wig so I am, I'm portraying a different likeness? Can I take that picture in front of that Fogo de Chao? Uh, not on your social media. You can do it on my social media if I'm not working there, though. Mm -hmm. And and you hide yourself. Yeah, I think you can. I'm not sure. I haven't like asked. I haven't asked all these questions yet. I've only asked. I've only asked the preliminary questions on this one. So I only have the preliminary answers as far as what. But that, that's the that's the basic latest uh, social media thing. So it's uh yeah it's 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 different. I mean, I, I, I mean, I don't want to say I get where they're coming from, um, in the sense of, but I do get that they don't want to be, they don't want, they want ex WWE wants to make exclusive deals. So, like, if, if yes, you're, yes, I understand, the Dave, but you know what? That has nothing to do with us taking a picture in front of Fogo to Chow. We ate there. We're not necessarily promoting their restaurant. I mean, but what if, what if WWE signs a deal with a different Brazilian steakhouse? What if they, like, uh, sign Well, they don't have a deal with another Brazilian steakhouse, so what the fuck difference does it make? Okay, but look, if here's they do, one. then we could talk about it then. Okay, what if they get make What if they make um, a deal with an uh, auto sponsor, okay? Right? And you take a picture in front of your car, and it's not the same brand. Think about that. Seems to me like you're allowed to own whatever car you want to own. Yeah, but you cannot... Unless they're the going to be giving you a car... Okay, but, if they've but, got a sponsorship with Tesla and all the wrestlers get a Tesla, then fine, you got to take a picture in front of your Tesla. Yeah. But if they sign to advertise Ford yeah. and you ain't getting shit, then you should be able to take a picture in front of any car you want to. Well, you can. You just can't advertise the car. You're not advertising the car. You're like, I'm in front of my house. It's snowing out. There happened to be a Ford <laughs> behind me. I'm not advertising the car. Well, as long as you don't say the make of the car, I think you're okay. It's like you can, as long as you don't, like, as long as, I think that you can, like, have the car in the background. Well, I know you can have the car in the, you can have a car in the background, but you cannot say, like, by the way, do you like my, um, do you like my neighbor's Tesla? That's crossing the line. You can't do that. Hey, if you're a big fan of Wrestling Observer Radio, we got 12,000 episodes of all of our podcasts up at our website, WrestlingObserver.com. If you sign up today, you get access to every single one of them. The 12 to 18 new shows that we do every single week. You can podcast them, listen to them on the road, at work, working out, in the shower, wherever you listen to your podcasts. And also full access to the Wrestling Observer newsletter and archives. So if you love what you hear, head to WrestlingObserver.com. 12,000 audio shows at your fingertips.